La Fontaine's Fables, The Fox and the Stork. Compress the fox once set himself on a fresh base. And rested to dinner gossip the stork. The treat was small, and without many primers. The gallant for every job. Had a clear wheelbarrow, he lived chickly. This wheelbarrow was served by him on a plate. The stork with the long beak could not catch crumb. And the funny had lapped it all in a moment. In order to avenge this deceit. Some time away, the stork praised him. Gladly, he said to him, because with my friends. I'm not giving ceremony. At the appointed hour he ran to the house. From the stork his hostess. Very loudly praised the politesse. Found the dinner cooked to good time. Bon appétit on everything, foxes are not lacking. He rejoiced at the smell of meat. Set in small pieces, and that he believed fond of. We served to embarrass him. In a vase with long neck, and narrow mouthpiece. The beak of the stork could well pass through it. But the sire's muzzle was another measure. He had to return to the house on an empty stomach. Shameful as a fox a hen would have taken. Tightening the tail, and holding the ear down. Deceptive, it is for you that I write. Expect the same.